morning, happy Saturday. Welcome to another weekly vlog. Today is February the 27th and it's Saturday. We're at Tatton Park this morning. Sun is shining. It's a beautiful morning. <laughs> um, everybody's here. We've got Harry, crazy granddad David and Emily are just ahead of me. Heading off for a nice walk. Getting a little bit warm. I wanted to put my new coat on. And I've just started and it's like so warm already. <laughs> Hopefully it'll be a bit cooler in the shade than it'll be justified wearing my coat. Not sure of the plans this weekend. Lots to do around the house again. But it's just lovely to be out in the fresh air. It's about lunchtime already. We've been busy this morning already. I've been out for a run. I had a great run this morning. 5k and I smashed my PB time, which is brilliant. I'd love to do it on a flat surface, like a track, and see how fast I could really go because quite hilly near where we live so lots of ups and downs so if I did it on a flat surface it would be amazing um yeah we have got picnic food with us gonna stop and have a spot of lunch just out in the fresh air but what a gorgeous start to the day um for those of you of you that don't know me I'm Diane part of UK Disney vlog and yeah doesn't it just make you feel so much better when the sun is shining? Incredible. I'll take you with us this weekend, as we have been doing this all year. See you in a bit. Such a lovely day. You gotta watch the poo around here though. Having a nice walk. Yeah. Oh, it's pretty here, isn't it? Yeah. Gorgeous view of the lake. So pretty. And the house is just over there, Tatton House. It's such a gorgeous day. I am getting a little bit warm and getting my coat. Um, just a lovely walk with fam. It's super busy. It's really, really, really busy, but. There's plenty of space, so it's not so bad. Oh, good. Oh, don't fall down there. <laughs> Almost fell down. If I fell down, wouldn't I just fall into the water? Yes, you would. That wouldn't be good, would it? No, it wouldn't. You know, I've swimming lessons for ages. No. <laughs> I don't fancy, I'm not coming to rescue you with my new coat on. I'll probably panic instead of swimming. Yeah, you would. And there's the other three, just up there. Go and catch them up. Okay. Don't stop for a picnic in a minute. Yeah. Harry is hungry as always, aren't you? What are you doing when you go back to school and you can't have a snack every 30 seconds? I will, I don't know. You're about to pack lunches and then eat when you've got the teachers tell you. you no know, watching telly during the day. Mm. You're looking forward to going back to school? Well, I'm looking forward to seeing my friends. Yeah, well, that's nice. It'll be lovely seeing your friends. It'll be good going back to school, I think. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> One more week of homeschooling. One more week? One more week. It's the last week of homeschooling, then it's back to school on Monday. So make sure your uniform still fits you. Make sure those snacks you've eaten. Have a... And then, a few more weeks, and it'll be summer term, and you'll be able to wait get some t-shirts and shorts you like the summer clothes don't you yeah most people just always wear the summer clothes yeah you don't have any yet we need to buy you some yeah right let's go and catch up with this lot just stop for a quick drink um oh god it's so beautiful it is stunning um carrying on for the rest of the walk now i think harry wants an ice cream because he spotted an ice cream truck so we're probably going to wait for one or go on back at the car park, not quite sure yet, but he will get an ice cream. How cool is this? That's really cool! That is certainly something you don't see every day. How cool was that bike? Right. Do you think you could ride it? 
No. I thought I was just in the Victorian time. No. Obviously not. We'll buy you one for your birthday. Yes, please. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's getting warm. Warm in that sun. Living the dream. Take it to him. They all for me. Yeah. It's a triple header. Do you want? I'm my ice cream. what I'm talking about. Nice. How's your ice cream? Good. You got a little bit of something up here. <laughs> Cheers. How's your ice cream? Nice. Can I have a quick look at it? No. Here we go, Mike. Off we go. Come on. Oh, then, let's run it back. Why are you running after me? Ready? 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 Oh, it's very get, getting very tense around here. Who's going to win the game of tic-tac-toe? Good move, Harry. Good move. Harry's got to play a bit of defense here. Won, I think we? it's going to be a stalemate and nobody wins. Oh, never mind. Stalemate. Good play, boys. Good play. So we had a lovely walk at um, Tatton Park and we have now just popped into Altrincham. Oh, it's Tim Hortons to try and see if I can get a bag of coffee and they have sold out. But we have got something else which I will show you in a bit. Picked up a coffee and a lamp. Um, yeah, I've got a lamp in my hand, which I am currently carrying. David's got one too. It's for the bedroom. I'm trying to furnish it. We just nipped into Wilkinson's to pick up some bits of cleaning products. I got some lamps while we were there. Forgot to buy bulbs though. So, <laughs> need to get some bulbs for it. Just for decoration at the minute. Actually, no practical function whatsoever. Still a beautiful day. It's now almost five o'clock in the afternoon. The sun is still shining and it's still a beautiful day. Like I said, we walked around Altrincham, picked up a few bits, went to Tesco's, picked up a more, more few bits, little bits of food that we needed. And then <laughs> an Easter egg and some Haribo. We do go through these moments where we buy food like, um, we've got the munchies again. David is just doing a little bit more decorating. <laughs> That's what I've got him busy doing on his days off. He loves it really. Um, as for the rest of the evening, not sure I've got planned yet. Um, Harry will obviously want to watch Saturday Night Takeaway because he is a massive fan of it. And we love it as well, it's good fun. It just brightens up your Saturday evenings. I love Ant and Deck, they are so great. Um, it's still a lovely day outside. I can't believe how light it is. It just makes you feel so much better that summer days are coming and warmer days and brighter and longer days. It just makes you feel so much more better. So much more better? That's such bad English. So much more positive and makes you feel so good. Yeah, all that vitamin D. Lovely day at Tatton Park, nice walk. Feels great, feels great after uh, two long days at work just to be out with the family. Fabulous. So if we do anything this evening, we'll obviously show you. We're not sure what we're having for tea yet. Bit of a debate. I think we should eat what's in the freezer, or the fridge, sorry. This lot want takeaway, so not quite sure what we're doing yet. Um, probably, they'll probably win, but yeah, we'll probably end up with takeaway, but let's not tell them that. 
so I'll see you in a bit. So I feel like I'm the Baker family now. Okay, so um, I feel <laughs> a little bit annoyed right now. I went on Ikea to order some stuff the other day. Didn't order it because we hadn't been paid yet. Obviously I wanted to make sure that we had enough funds in the bank to last us. Um, but on it yesterday or this morning to order it, I could have collected it in our local Ikea, which is probably about a 20 minute drive away, for the cost of five pounds. Didn't do it for some reason because I was busy. Came back to order it now and I can get it from Sheffield. I live in Manchester. I can pick it up in store for cost of five pound, but drive to Sheffield for it. So I don't know what's gone out of stock from Manchester. Um, so I thought, right, I'll do delivery, see how much that costs. So delivery is four pound, so it's cheaper to get it delivered than it is to go and collect it. When I've then gone through to the collection, I can't get it for two weeks now. So two weeks I can get my IKEA order. So I try doing a few options, see if it takes stuff out, put stuff in, whatever, and then ugh, to see if that'd help. My Manchester store didn't even come up anymore. Um, still showing Sheffield, then Warrington. Warrington didn't have all the items. So people have been going mad for Ikea today, apparently. And I thought, right, I'll get another picture frame. To get another picture frame, then makes the delivery cost 15 pounds. To, up, to post it, because obviously it makes it that much heavier. I was like, why is it now 15 pound? Took the picture frame out and it's now just cost me four pound again. <laughs> so I have ordered my stuff from Ikea, which is going to be here in over two weeks now. Um, this is supposed to be to finish my bedroom off. I ordered some shelves. I ordered a picture frame for this amazing print that I've ordered from Redbubble from Mr. David and Mr. Ian, which I will show you when the lighting's better. I'm not gonna show you now, I might show you tomorrow or to get there to insert a picture. Um, but yeah, I ordered an amazing print from Redbubble from Mr. David and Mr. Ian. That collection, it's Kevin slash alien creation. So it's amazing. Um, and some cushions and some couple of shelves. But yeah, two weeks now in my bedroom might finally be finished. This calls for gin time. <sighs> that tastes good. So eventually it might get finished. I'm gonna go and drink my gin and do some shopping because I have had a big birthday. We're not gonna talk about that anymore. It's been done, gone, and I've waffled about it enough, but it's David's big birthday in two weeks. Yeah, less than two weeks. So in about 10 days, it's David's big birthday. He's gonna be 40 as well. So he's joining me in the um, in the 40s at the minute. He's still in the 30s and doesn't he let me know it. So I might go and do some secret shopping and see what we can get him for his birthday. Good morning, you lovely lot. How are you all doing this morning? Sorry about last night. I forgot to end the evening's vlog. Um, we ordered takeaway again. <laughs> oh my God, it's getting so bad. If it's not too good to go, it's a takeaway. There's no wonder I'm not losing any weight, despite all the exercise. So yeah, we ordered a takeaway. I ordered an Indian. David and the kids ordered a Domino's. I ordered mine first, thinking they would arrive at similar times. Mine didn't all come until about an hour after theirs. So I was starving watching them eat theirs. I didn't want any of the pizza or anything because I knew I wouldn't be able to eat mine. And then the longer it took, the more grumpier I got. <laughs> yeah, if you can imagine it. I get really, really grumpy and the slightest thing like that can just set me off. So then I was in a mood for the rest of the, for a while of the night. Indian was okay. Some of it was a bit lukewarm, very disappointed. Um, but then again, it didn't start off very well with it being an hour late. David and I then have started to watch Grey's Anatomy. Yes, we have committed to watching Grey's Anatomy. Not sure if we're quite mad or what. Um, it's a big commitment, I know, but why not? <laughs> but why not? I'm sure we're going to flit in and out of it. Maybe not binge watch every night because we would end up just resenting it, I think. So I think we do need to intermingle other series into it as well. Um, so if you've got any um, recommendations for a Netflix series, leave a comment down below because that would be amazing. I think today is going to be fueled by coffee. I need coffee. Um, probably about seven hours sleep. I have an inability to sleep past half seven. Once I get up to go to the toilet, that is it. 
I can't switch my brain off and I can't do anything. So yeah, I'm tired now. Very, very, very tired. Start nights this week. So I should be able to get a bit of rest before then. Um, going to go and do a workout now. I'm not going for a run this morning. Just going to do some strength training, which I think is really, really important um, to see if I can get stronger legs, get faster. Um, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. And then I'm going to have some breakfast. As for the rest of the day, it's DIY day again. Yay! Who doesn't love to watch us do DIY? I think David's going to finish um, decorating the stairs. There's a bit of a stairs, the wallpaper that we had to take off. Um, and he's taking the rest of it off and he's going to wallpaper this section because it's a similar wallpaper that we have for the bedroom, or the same wallpaper that we have for the bedroom, sorry. Once everyone's up, I'll take you upstairs and show you what is underneath that wall, underneath the wallpaper. It's incredible. Totally incredible. Um, I'm probably going to get in the garden today, even though it is freezing right now. It's um, obviously been freezing overnight. The ground's all frosty, but I want to get in the garden. I've got a tip run to do. It's all go around here this morning. It's all go. So obviously take you with us, <laughs> show you all of our interesting sights. I'll see you in a bit once I've done my workout. So the workout is done. I've had some breakfast, had a great cup of coffee. I've uh, been watching some vlogs this morning. So I watched Seashawn vlog, um, cheers is. Been watching a bit of Nibbles and Bubbles as well. But can you see it? Can you? Yeah. So we had to take this section of wallpaper down and this is what we discovered underneath. Do you like it guys? No. No? I think they're all mute in this family. Ah, we, all right, we're keeping it then. No. Yeah, I think we should keep it. It's beautiful. No, it's not. Oh, it's going. We're gonna wallpaper it and then paint over it. It's going. Bye bye. What another beautiful, gorgeous day. We are back out in the garden, doing lots of maintenance and DIY. I'm making Harry do some gardening, aren't I, mate? Yep. And you're trying to negotiate with me, aren't you? Yeah. I get paid. He wants to pay in for doing his digging. So hole. this is just a plot of weeds currently and Harry's doing the digging. I did make a hole. We've got the washing out as well which is great another sunny day. I've even got not got a t-shirt on. Still trying to tackle these giving it the last bit of paint hopefully the sun will help it and David's gonna jet wash them in a minute. And he's also fixing these Another thing we need to do is tackle that. Does anybody else have a garage full of rubbish? As we do, don't we? I want to make it nice at the minute. It's not. That is our aim, but it's beautiful. It's the 28th of February and it's a gorgeous sunny day. It's currently... Watch never works when you want it to, does it? Nope. My Apple Watch decides to go off. Yeah, it's probably about 12 degrees in the sun and it's beautiful. Best crack on. Lot to do. Just stopped for a five minute lunch break, but look, it's outside. First time this year, we're sitting outside. How amazing is that? And it's not even March yet. Is it gonna get cold though next week? Hmm? Is it getting cold again next week? I don't know. But it's beautiful. Probably. It's so lovely to be outside. Not a lot of work to do though. Soaking those vit vitamin D rays. So nice now the pressure, <laughs> pressure washer's not on. I bet our neighbours absolutely love us at the minute. Oh, I'm chill. I'm closing my eyes thinking I'm in Port Orleans Riverside. So after many hours of work, this has been all blasted and these are now pretty much paint free. I just need to dry off, fix this bit a little bit and then sand it. But I am knackered. I need a beer, but we don't have any. We could do with a nice glass of cold beer. Um, these are going to dry in the sun, we're going to tidy up and we'll go to the tip. I've got like blisters 
on my fingers from all the gardening. I need about a grand. Anyone wants to give her like a just giving page just for me? <laughs> I'm joking. Um, I just need all this money to do this garden. Yeah, that's what we need. You tired, love? Mm -hmm. All knackered. Need to head to the tip now. Yay! Exciting. Are we with everybody else in uh, Greater Manchester? So I sit here now with a glass in my hand because the sun is beautiful. Come on, let's get cracking because it'll no doubt get really cold really quickly. Just got back from the tip. We thought we'd sit on our chairs. They're just dry, all drying out nicely. Um, went to the local Nisa and got an amazing haul. Who needs to go to like search the internet for 80s food? Just go to the local Nisa. They had such an incredible range, I could have um, spent a fortune. Um, the beer is obviously not 80s, but crack it open, dude. But look at this haul. Okay, skip. Transformers snacks. Honest to God, cheeseburger flavour quarterbacks. I've not seen these for years. Space Raiders beef. And there was loads more I could have picked. So I'm just going to go and try some of these. So I'm going to start with these cheeseburger flavour quarterbacks. You know what one? I'll grab one. Not this time. Yeah. Flavoring. Not quite sure what that is. Is it supposed to be cheese or beef? All I can taste is the space raiders. Yeah, I think the jury's out with that one. The next one is the beef transformers. Oh my. Aren't you supposed to be able to make cars and stuff like that? No, I like them. Next. Space Raiders. It's a totally different flavour of beef. You're having fun over there making your car. Yeah, I've got my wheels the wrong way around. Very good. And last but not least is the skips. Leave a can of hit me. <coughs> you don't handle any skips. <coughs> you might have to cut that bit out. Oh, they're good. Might have to start buying them again. They are really, really nice. I think we're going to the shop more often, won't we? Absolutely. Cheers. Happy Sunday. Harry Anderson, what are you doing? Getting to the centre of the earth. Centre of the earth? Oh my god. <laughs> Try and pull your leg out then. <laughs> Making trump noises. <laughs> Um, Go on, get your foot out. <laughs> Are we? <s> <laughs> ah, oh my god! I oh, want a nice garden, not a mud patch. What I think you are, George Pig. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna I like jumping in muddy puddles. Are you scared? Yeah. Uh. Is it wax on? Wax off. Mm. 
So I've had a nice lovely bath and it's now dark and we're about to have dinner. But somehow we ended up with this. I have never had instant mash in my life. So I thought I'd do a taste test. So this is what it looks like. So you put 30 grams of instant mash with 150 mils of milk. Milk, water, but just boiling water. Water. This looks like baby food, and I'm supposed to mix it up with a fork. So here is the mashed potato. I loosely slate, slay, say mashed potato. I, I'm not sure I can even do it. Mmm. It's got a potato flavour about it. I'd rather eat that. Yeah, I'd rather eat that too. Um, what's so hard about boiling a potato? This is just next level. It's like, I don't know, Play-Doh? Yeah, it, it's a no from me. I get it's got its place. Come on guys, just boil a potato and add some butter. Just had dinner, which was absolutely lovely. Just had a chicken Kiev and something really simple, but it was really nice. Proper could eat a Sunday roast though. Watching the cages live on Facebook. So if you don't check them out already, please go do so. But my hands are so dry and awful after all that gardening. So I got this for my birthday, a tea tree and peppermint deep moisturising hand mask. So I'm going to put this on while I watch the cages for 20 minutes. It probably just says, yeah, thoroughly wash and dry hands, take out unfolded gloves and put on for 15 minutes. So I will give it a go and see how it goes. They feel so strange. It's like so squishy but satisfying. They smell amazing. So it's tea tree and peppermint. It just smells incredible. Remove and fix. I can't wait to try these on. Looks like a really good size. So if you've got the larger hands, they should fit too. So I've got the gloves on. They're a little bit weird. What do you reckon, Harry? Can you smell them? Yeah, they smell like... Mint. Like, yeah. Oh my god, they feel really strange. I've got a blister here which is absolutely stinging, but they are really, really strange. So you you pop them on and then just oh wait wait twenty minutes apparently. They feel really weird. Yeah. It feels... Why do I feel like it's got like I don't I don't put my fingers in it, but it really feels like it's got like cream. It has got cream in it, I think. Hmm. But they just feel very very strange. Hopefully my hands will be beautifully soft by the time I finish. Okay. So I'll see you in 15 minutes. So it's a little while later. I am now tucked up in bed. Um, I've just been watching Grey's Anatomy. Had a cookie and ice cream dessert um, and an ice green tea. I, had, um, I do like green tea. I had the um, green and lemon tea and I had the what, Twinings one. And now I'm a massive fan of Aldi, but the Twinings tea, green tea and lemon, taste so much nicer. Maybe I'll just start buying better tea. Yeah, it proves that you have to buy good stuff. So that's it. That's the end of another weekend vlog. Another weekend in lockdown, another weekend decorating. There's just never ever enough hours in a weekend. I suppose unless you get up really early, there's just never enough hours in the day. Um, and we did. We got up really early. I got up early, did a workout. There, that's anyway. So if you've made it to the end of this vlog, thank you very much. Thank you so much for watching everybody. Um, please give us a big thumbs up if you've managed to watch this unmakeup face all day, right to the end. I, w I really appreciate it. Um, and thank you. Just don't forget to leave any comments down below. I love hearing from everybody. 
give us a big thumbs up and if you're not already subscribed please subscribe to our channel and i will see you again next week for another weekly vlog thanks for watching guys bye, -bye.